Hi, Cynthia here. Back today working on my mini album that I did for my stepdaughter at Christmas. So I'm going to have a little mini series running up on my channel. Um, mini Monday, I'll call it, where I work on the layouts from the album. So if you haven't seen it already, I had a... Um, a video about all the products that I'm going to use. So I'm using a Heidi Swap Planner as the actual cover and the pages from it. And then I've gone through my stash and I pulled out some product that I wanted to use on this album. So I'm trying my hardest to stick to that product as well. So I'm using these rub-ons here, which are absolutely gorgeous and just work so beautifully. Uh, there's a few sheets that come with the pack that I've used a couple of the sheets up already, but I still have these left. I actually won these um, for, I can't remember, a competition from a YouTuber, um, Caitlin Cleary, actually. Um, and I still have a few of the banners or border strips left, so I've just used those down there. And now I'm going through the ephemera packs that I'm going to be using throughout this mini album. Most of them are from the um, reject shop or the $2 shop that we have here in Australia. So with the album, all the pages are just basically going to be pretty. I've just... I don't know a lot of the people that are in some of the photos. I know some people, but a lot of them I don't. Obviously, I know Carly, who's my stepdaughter. I know she's in the photos or in some of the photos, but I don't know a lot of the people that she's with. And so there's no journaling on my behalf. I Each year, I do give her a little mini album, and I do tell her to go in and put her own little bit of journaling in. I don't think she does, but... Um, you know, the options always there. So I just basically make them pages look pretty here. I have actually posted the album off, so I'm doing the voiceover for this video on the 17th of December 2017, if you're looking in the future. Um, and I have put the album in the post, so it's winging her way to her as we speak which does mean I can't tell you what actually were on any of the strips. I know the big top one there says positive vibes, but can't really remember what the bottom one says. I know by the time you are watching this, it's going to be nice and big and we'll be able to read it. But at the moment, I couldn't tell you what it is. So the washi tape that I'm using here, the black and white polka dot washi tape, I use this washi tape on every layout so there's two things that I tried to make sure were on every layout the washi tape and there's some little hearts that um, I had a couple of sheets of hearts that have been in my stash for ever and a day and I've decided I want to use those up I may not have started using them right at the beginning but I certainly went back and added them Look at that one. That one's done and that's just pretty and looks nice. So most of the time I just flipped them over and started on the back page. But this one I've obviously just grabbed a new picture. So each video I will try to keep reasonably short. Around the 7 to 10 minute mark. So it's not too long. Just deciding what blue I should use. Should I use this raindrop looking one or something else? And I actually end up going for this black, I think. Pretty sure I go back to the black and use the black polka dot. Because obviously she's got um, you know, a lot of black hair. So I think it's just went well with this. Photo. So I'm trimming it out. I tried to leave the paper pads in the 
um, the pages in the actual paper pad as much as I can so I don't have loose pages floating around everywhere. Gone through this sticker sheet, seeing what I can use. Thought I might use it, believe, but I end up not using it. I, I go a different direction in the end. I'm having a look to see whether I use it, but no, I don't. I'll put that back on the sheet. The blue just wasn't quite the right blue. doesn't go with a headband. And it was too much of a clash, so I decided not to use it, but I'm having a look through to see what else I can do. And once again, with these pages, I'm just trying to stick it down, just do it, commit, and not mess around too much. I'm trying to make it nice and quick and simple. Two reasons for that. One is um, because I just want to, you know, I just want to short little pages, just do it, practice just putting things down. And two, when I was doing this, I had um, three or four things that were on the go at once and I had to get them done. I had to get this finished and get it in the post in time. I had another couple of albums that I was working on for my granddaughters. I had to get them done. I had um, design team commitments that I had to get finished as well. So it was like everything was just crazy. So my plan was just try to get one page done no more than you know 15 minutes a page when I when I was doing two or three in a row I could easily get that done but each time I started new it took me a little bit longer so this one's coming to an end as well I'm just putting down the washi tape that as I said I've used through them all there's no close-up photos for any of these um, pages just quick pages I hope you enjoyed watching them as I said each Monday I'll try to put a new video up for this series um, until we get them all done it'll probably be half a dozen or so and that will be it give me a thumbs up if you like this video and if you'd like to see more and I'll catch you on the next one talk to you then bye